What's up, guys? Well, look who decided to show up. Old man winter. Dropped, I don't know, three or four inches of snow today, but I don't know if you can tell. It just turned into freezing rain and is going to end up raining tonight and tomorrow. And I think tomorrow's going to be 50. So this would have made for a killer snow ride today or this weekend, but it's probably not going to last that long. So it stinks, but whatever. So today we got to get this old girl prepped and ready for the first round of the GNCC series. I'm just gonna make a quick little video. Some of the things I need to do to get this girl ready, which some of that includes removing my heated grips, removing my headlight, changing the gas tank to my quick fill, uh, put my brand new tires on there, do an oil change, a filter change, hook up the 24 volt battery system, I'm gonna check out the clutch and inspect that, make sure that's all good. Um, plastics, I'm gonna get those plastics on there. And then I just gotta change those pink graphics uh, to my normal black ones. Those were from Iron Man. So we'll peel those off and change those to the normal black ones. Um, I gotta get some goggles ready. Uh, get my gear ready. Let's see what my list says. Oh, I'm going to do a new chain and sprockets on this thing. Because these are worn. I don't know if you can tell, but... Yeah, that's definitely worn. So we're going to put a brand new chain and sprockets on there. Um, I think that's pretty much it. So I'm going to get to work and uh, just video what I end up getting done today. I don't know if I'll do this all today, but I'm going to try to do most of it. So I'm going to capture some of that on video and let you guys see it. All right, so stay tuned. So far, I got the oil drained. I replaced the foot pegs because my previous ones were a little bent up. So I changed those. And then I got some new nets. So I removed the old ones. I'm going to put the new ones on a little bit later. As far as me inspecting clutch, I inspected the clutch. And I didn't like the way the plates looked. So I just changed them. I had a new set already broken in. So we changed those. So the clutch will be brand new. So that's going to be good for round one. So, and I did notice, I mean, it was tough to tell at last week's ride, 
I kind of noticed like it was slipping, but it was tough to tell because of the conditions, it was kind of frozen, kind of muddy, and it just seemed like everybody was kind of just, it just felt like you were spinning the whole time. So, but after looking at the plates, they, they start, they're starting to look like they're glazed over. I'll show you guys. So I didn't really like how they were looking. Like, you know, for the, this one, for example, definitely looks a little bit smoked. Smells a little bit smoked. So this one too, it's a little discolored. So just a couple of them are like that. I mean, this one's not, oh yeah, this one is too. So, yeah. So it was time. I mean, these had a solid season on them plus practice rides. So I got my money's worth. And rather than uh, blow out a clutch again, I figured it'd be better to be safe than sorry and just change it now. So that's what I did. So now we're just filling this thing up with oil. A little shout out to Blood Lubricants. I just recently switched to their oil. So far I'm loving it. It does not break down super fast like the previous oil I was using. Um, works well with the recluse so so far so good so definitely happy with it it's a good choice so i highly recommend if you guys haven't tried this stuff it's good stuff um so that's it so i'm gonna go get i'm gonna go get my nets because they're in the house and then uh i think next we'll remove the tires we'll remove the chain and sprockets and then tackle that so that'll be next so stay tuned
what's up guys so we are here again afternoon number two uh, continuing the GNCC round one quad prep as you guys can see it did rain all night even a little bit this morning so now it's just a big sloppy mess so I'll show you where I ended up finishing yesterday I got a lot done did pretty good so yesterday I got the tires done I got all my heated grips off I got the light off I got my normal grips on I got the quick fill tank on I did my chain and sprockets that's all new I changed the oil uh, I did uh, inspect the clutch and actually replace the steels and friction because those were shot um, so today I have to let's see my list all right so today I got to take care of my 24 volt battery setup uh, put a fresh air filter in and then get the gra get the plastics on and then change those graphics um, so I should be able to bang this out this afternoon and get this guy ready to go and then I'll start on my gear, which I'm not going to make a video about that, but uh, that's easy easy enough. All my gear is new, so I'll just load that up and then just get my helmet set up um, with my stickers, my class sticker, get my goggles set up. That's all easy enough. Um, and that's it. So here we go. Told you what to chase Told you how to run the race Every move was on the page But I didn't like their way Had to fight and misbehave Had to find a way to change Had to leave to find my way Caught up in a daydream I beat my mind up there almost daily It's how I pass time, no opinions safely It's how I understand what I want in this place see. Cause everybody wanna tell you bad things What could go wrong, what fame brings But success is a finicky thing And if you ain't sure, no, it'll never be I don't wanna let myself down myself Ready for ten seconds. I think I am. So I got everything done. She's all cleaned up and she is ready to race. Now it does suck. My new bike's not ready yet. It's not going to be ready for at least two more months. But I'll give you guys a little bit of a teaser. I'm sure you may have seen it in some videos here and there. Parts and pieces of it along with social media. So this is where I'm at with the new bike. Not very far. So I do have just about all my parts. They're scattered throughout the garage and in my basement. So it's just a matter of 
just spending a little time in here and getting back to this thing which i already did start making a, a little video nothing crazy pretty much just time lapse the whole thing so far i mean realistically this is only about six hours of work um so but i do have a lot more to, to get to i am waiting on some ball joints for my a-arms that's kind of stopping me from doing the front end you know i got the swing arm ready to go bearings are in it all the bangs are in the a-arms I got my radiator right there. I mean, I got I got parts everywhere. Parts scattered everywhere. I mean, I got my shock. You can see new cables right there. I got my my sprocket hub, my front wheel hubs, my rear rotor bracket. I got a brand new carrier right here. I got a, a skid plate buried somewhere in this mess. There's the LSR spindles. There's a new chain. I got some new sprockets up there for it. I mean, it's just, it's just a mess. I have plastics, brand new plastics also in the basement. I'm waiting for my graphics. Those should be in soon, hopefully. Um, so then it's just a matter of getting my gear organized and uh, just packing up what I'm going to need for this first race. So I'm not going to lie. I'm actually getting pretty excited for this first round. I was dreading it almost in a way. It just never seems like you have enough time to get things ready. But, uh. We are a week and a half away from uh, race day, round one, big buck GNCC. So the machine's ready, I'm ready, and uh, I can't wait. I'm excited. Got my buddy Mike, who's going to be driving his RV uh, for this round. And then we will take turns on the next round for Florida and Georgia. I'm going to take my rig, my camper, and then my truck. So that'll definitely help out this season switching off on vehicles oh, and that's pretty much it guys so if you like the content please subscribe if you got any questions shoot me a comment you know like the videos um and subscribe i think i already said that but please subscribe the channel's growing fast uh i hit 800 subscribers yesterday which it's crazy i mean i'll give you guys a look right now it's probably going up a little bit more it's it's really starting to uh it's really starting to go daily go up and up and up so right now we are at 834 so we're almost at that 1k goal guys so come on share share these videos get them out there get your friends to subscribe if they're not and uh help me to get this channel help me to grow it i think it can be really great so i got a lot of cool things planned along with racing videos um so i'm excited to do do all that and then obviously once the weather gets better we can really get some good riding and some good video and uh get some good content so guys please subscribe throw me a thumbs up and i'll see you on the next video On my shoulder cause they treat me like an outcast I ain't gonna take that, stay back I'll be swinging hard till the hits come in all caps I ain't gonna lay back, pray that Someone's gonna help me, ain't nobody like that I ain't gonna wait, that's all fat Give me one shot and I'll never get the